Hi, I'm David. Recently I offered a, uh, a service for um, Auto Supply UK forum members to be able to purchase items from Yahoo Japan auctions um, by me acting, acting as a middleman and uh, placing a bid for you and uh, sending the item to you in either the UK or Canada or America, um, wherever you may be. Okay, so I had many requests asking how to actually do a search on the Yahoo Japan auctions. Okay, the best way to do it, because the page changes frequently, is to um, just go to the top page, uh, paste in a Figaro script in uh, Japanese, uh, choose your refining option and do search. Okay, I'll show you how to do that now. Okay, so on the Auto Supply UK forum, uh, I have a post here. Okay, it might be quite difficult to see. It's under Yahoo Japan Auction Service, where it's got my email. Um, my handle is just Dave. Okay, so let's forward into that email, into that post again. Okay, and it'll show down here the script in Japanese. Okay, so forum members type in the keyword figure. Okay, so it's quite easy what you do. Just copy that. Go back to our Yahoo auction. Go into the search bar. Paste Figaro in the search bar. Go to the section second option. Second option, okay. And what we need to choose is motor cars and motorbikes. It's the eleventh from the top, from the first blue bar. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Select that. Then press search. So, Figaro script, 11th from the top, search. Okay, I'll press search and that will load in a moment. Okay, the page is loaded. Okay, as in eBay auctions, um, we'll have multiple pages of items for sale, depending on the item. We'll have a initial picture, a brief description, seller information, the first bid price, initial bid price for the item, uh, number of bidders, and days remaining. Okay, let's go in and have a look at uh, Figaro Stereo. Okay, um, I'm accessing this portal from my iPhone at the moment, so it might take a little bit to load. Okay, so here's the main sellers page for the original Figaro Stereo. Okay, a picture. Okay, the bid amount, time, time remaining, number of bids. So two bids and one day remaining. Initial starting price of 5,260 yen. Okay, so scroll down a little further and we'll see additional pictures of the stereo. from the original catalogue. Okay, so if we scroll down further, we can also see, just below the picture, a description of the item. Now, if you'd like to know what this says, it's quite easy to do just by going to Google Translate. Now, that's easy enough by just highlighting the script, pressing Copy, going to Google Translate, Okay, so we're in Google, Google Language Tools, uh, Google Language Tools. Okay, text translation, paste, uh, Japanese, English, translate, and wait for it to load. Okay, so and here we have information. Okay, it says it's in a good state and there are small scratches consistent with age and degradation. So it gives us a basic idea. The translation isn't the best, but it'll give you a better idea than um, just the Japanese script if you can't speak Japanese. Okay, so back to the auction. Okay, so now you've found the item you want. You can see there are a number of days, a number of days left on it. Okay, so if you would like me to place a bid on it for you, 
you just copy the URL at the top, copy, and go to your email client and uh, send me an email. Okay, and my email is Japan Auction Service at gmail.com. Okay, so just paste that link for the auction in there and tell me the maximum bid that you're willing to pay for the item. I'll place the bid for you and let you know if you've won. Okay, so also you can refine your searches a little more. I'll just go back to the main page and here you have other options the price the number of bidders time remaining okay so you can press on either of those buttons and it'll adjust the auction list accordingly okay so and it's easier than you think okay thank you